That's not how we start the Daihatsu. Hey guys. Alright, so it's now. Um, we're, well, continuation, continuation from um, the other day where we were trying to run it. So we figured out the coil was dead. Um, I don't think I got that on camera, I can't remember. So we figured out that the coil was in fact dead, so we wasn't getting, we were not getting any spark whatsoever. So obviously there's our coil. So what we're gonna do is, is we got a good one here. We've got a good coil here, so we're just gonna throw that coil in and hopefully we should get some spark. We're actually gonna check it this time. We're gonna whip the plugs out. And what we're gonna do is, is we're gonna try and uh, bleed it up we're, going to, we're just going to run at the moment, we've just got our little hose here. So we're just going to run that into a, into a little water bottle over there with the orange stuff in it, which is actually Dad's two-stroke fuel. So we're just going to take that out. We're going to, I'm going to go to the servo and get some actual um, petrol, some proper, proper 91. And we'll, we'll get some um, valve saver fluid too. And we'll add that into the tank. So valve saver fluid just for cars that used to run on leaded fuel. So obviously... It's not really good to put unleaded fuel in this little thing because in 20 years I don't reckon she's had unleaded fuel in her ever, in her ever. So what we're going to do is, is we're just going to undo the drain plug off the bottom of the uh, little fuel tank here. And the fuel actually doesn't smell too bad, surprisingly, um, much to my belief. It's actually... Not really that. Wow, there's a lot in there. Okay, that smells like varnish. And we're not going to try and run her on that. Wow, she had a full tank of fuel in her. <laughs> well, I'll be buggered. Or at least we know the tank's good. It definitely does smell real nice. So I'm just going to get this petrol off my hands before I melt. So there was a high chance wherever I put my rag done a full lap of the car I still don't have my rag over here um, it probably would have ran on the fuel that was in it it had a full tank I can't believe that it's still run look I've had a bit of help from Mitch he's popped up here tonight he's in, boots. He's in these Ugg boots he just got crackalated by the crackinator so all we're going to do is, is we've just got our new little fancy McJigger there and our uh, coil lead. It's seen better days. It's not going to zoom in on it, is it? Why won't that zoom in? Okay, well, we're just going to go like this. There. It's fuckalated. So we've got to unfuckalate it by getting another one, which means we're going to have to pull this fancy little bracketry off here because that goes to the battery clamp. Mitch is going to do them up so tight that they go loose and he's going to back them off half a turn. <laughs> Talk to spec. <laughs> That'll probably do it, I was only joking. <laughs> okay. Alright, so do you know how these go? That's adjustable. <laughs> For adjustable voltage. It's getting fixed. I'm going to fix no, this. No, you, you need to use a screwdriver. Pull that to about there. Alright. And put the screwdriver acts as locking pin and just ba bang. Oh. There's a jigger in there. You don't have to take that bolt out. Oh. Oh. Clamp up. Is this fucking. Oh man. It's making everything so much harder. So... Is that going to work in there? Train! I can't hear now. Look, there's a helicopter. Train! <laughs> it's actually a train, yeah. Oh, that's hectic! Choo choo, bitch! Look, there it is! <laughs> it's a pineapple! Choo the train! <laughs> okay, so we, we that plug lead, the lead's not gonna work, so. Why? Well, because it's a spark plug lead, not a coil lead. <laughs> So that'll, that'll get that done for starters. Okay, now there has to be a coil lead here somewhere. Here we go. 
Hmm. That one's a possibility. And what have we got here? What's that one there? No, it's another one. Yeah, this one. That's a spark plug lead. Ah! Ah! There it is. We found it. It's a little bit shorter than the other one, so we might be we might be pushing for uh, for it to work, but we will give it a try. Give it a try. Give it a try. That's not how we start the Daihatsu. What happens? It's still powered. <laughs> Rough. Again. <laughs> Spit on it. Told you that it worked, didn't I? It worked. <laughs> We've got the big 10 mil Top Gun Pro Racing Series ignition coil lead. And this bad boy is going to supply that much spark to this little engine. And it's just fireball. Do, 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 do. It's got to spark all of the fuel. All of the... Fucking nin... Mint. It even has the original Daihatsu coil. Obviously, you see the little D on the top there? Your mum did. Anyway, it's the same as the D that's on the, that's on the oil filler cap. So you know it's, it's genuine Daihatsu. We're going to have to top her up with a little bit of cooling juice. Because obviously she's a bit on the... Uh, Empty side. We've checked the engine oil. She's got engine oil. What are you doing? Trying to smoke. Yeah, all right. What we're gonna do is we're gonna put this little jiggy in the back with the uh, <clears throat> with the battery clamp. I like that. That's good. So you're gonna get that together. And Mitch is gonna put all the terminals on the correct way because he totally seen how to come apart we're going to spray a little bit of start also elect electricism electricism oh she got she got good food levels everything's well shit so much easier to just sit here and film while everyone does the work you're having fun. I can see the smile on your face. Hey. Hey. <laughs> Man, I can't wait to take this thing down to Hobart to get on the piss. Oh, how'd you go with that Land Rover? Oh, shit. <laughs> yes, the spark plugs are different sizes. If it fits, it ships. All I can smell is stagnant petrol. The petrol that there was like this much petrol or whatever. I don't know what it was. What's that spark plug look like? Don't you, you fucking why? Auto elect. Shit. You got sandpaper? It's fucking real bad. You do this, right? You got this. <laughs> Good. Will this Daihatsu for Ro for Rosa? Will this Daihatsu for Rosa Rocky start after thirty-seven thousand years of sitting upside down in a shed with no sunlight? Which one is number three? We don't know. This one. We didn't mark them. It doesn't really matter. Okay, so just. just Whoa! No sparky. We're just gonna pull that off there for now. <coughs> yep, that works. Hmm. Put that on upside down. Oh yeah, I have to. It's gotta go that way. Oh, lovely. Okay. 
So what we're going to do is now is we're going to pull this little cap off here. And we're going to have a look at the points. Holy shit. They are fucked. Okay. I'm going to pull the road button off and have a look at that. Yeah, it can do with a good clean. What are the points like, actually? I'm going to need my light for this. There we go. Now we're just going to have a look at the points. A little bit not happy. But we should hopefully be able to get a file. Oh, fuck. There's like nothing left of the points. So what we're going to do is we're going to file the points down a bit. And then we are going to get a bit of emery paper in on these contacts in here. And we're also... <laughs> Man. We're also going to give the uh, the rotor button a bit of a go. <laughs> a bit of a once-over with the paper as well. We'll be back. We'll be back after this. It appears that our little Daihatsu was actually used in the drug dealing trade. Some good quality ice right there. Holy shit. Yeah, look, I think we're not going to bother cleaning this cap. It's absolutely frosted up beyond repair.